Hi there, my friend. Many of us come to the point in life where we feel like giving up, where we feel it's all too much to ask and it would be much easier to just disappear and be done with it. Many of us come to despise everyone around us, including ourselves, and to loathe what human living seems to be about. It is usually because something has gone terribly wrong for us. We've fallen out with people. We feel we've made mistakes. We feel we've failed. We feel we've lost the things that gave us hope once upon a time. And we feel that simply life is not going to work out for us. But that is, of course, a very partial view of things, and it is a view that is determined very much by exactly what has gone wrong. And my experience, my nearly 50-year experience of working with people who find themselves in that situation, is that there's always a good reason why that happens. You never feel like that for nothing. And it is always possible to figure it out and to find a way through the knot, to undo it, to understand what's gone wrong, to set aside the things that make you unhappy and depressed and anxious, and to find the motivation, the desire and the appetite back to make something good of your life instead because that's possible it's always possible but you know it takes some undoing first and then it takes a lot of redoing or creating of good structures surround yourself with things that are worthwhile that make you feel like you're blossoming that make you feel like life is worthwhile but you can do it. And it is a puzzle that you can solve. It is a puzzle you are made to solve because it's a puzzle that many of us end up having to find the solution to. So give it a go. Figure out why things have become so horrible, so knotted up, And then just remember, if you're willing to stop your entire life, you can surely cut the Gordian knot and get rid of some of those things that really make your life a misery. You can move away or get a new job or recreate yourself or study something new. You can do all sorts of things to create that new life that will work for you. But you have to be willing to work at it, to not be complacent, to not play the blame game, to not be passive and to not think other people got to sort it out for you. If you're willing to take responsibility, step up to the plate. You can do it, mate. Come on, have another go at it and figure it out. Read some good books that inspire you. Keep watching some good videos too. And have some trust in yourself and some faith in life. Because life will be with you when you choose to be on the side of life. Take care of that life, because it's precious. Take care of it.